Alright, what's up guys? I'm finna be uh, installing this drop kit on my truck. Uh, I got some new headlights for it too, so I'm gonna be showing you how this thing goes. So I can see right now I don't have the headlights on or the front bumper is getting painted. I got my boy Richard, which is about to help out. Compa BJ, out there too. You know, my messy backyard, but look. I know, I've seen that shit. He was trying to put a fucking Bucky sticker on the truck. I had to take that shit off. But look, I got the headlights, the rear axle flip kit, and a three inch springs. Right now, it's only sitting on two inch shackles and stock at the front. So I'm gonna put in the headlights first. And I'll get working on the suspension right after. Here you go. That does make more sense, right? Three what? inches down. What? No, because there's like three inches on the There's a whole fucking foot. Wait, uh, like three inches from the, from the other ones? Yeah. So from right here, I think one time this count like seven inches. Yeah. It's going to be like seven. It's going to be yeah, like... Nigga, how the hell straight? I don't know. Nigga, this whole straight as fuck, bro. Yeah, know, it's going to be like this, right? <laughs> like that low from the back. <laughs> The but it's also straight. It makes you look gay. Oh, what? That makes sense. It does make sense. It's also low. <laughs> what is that? It's also straight. It makes you look gay. Like, that's a good thing, you know? Oh, man. Look, look, look the comments. The comments, the comments, the comments section knows. Okay. Now I'm going to edit that part out. <laughs> 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 Oh, so this is all you're doing right now? Just, oh no, you're gonna do all that. Okay. And then the drop kit right after. I'm just putting the headlights on right now. All right, we just got these headlights on. Close the hood. Looks a little nicer than before. I like it. I'm just waiting on that lower valence coming out the paint shop. And now we're finna get started on the rear drop first because I think that's a little bit easier. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get started on this side. I don't know, like people when they record fights. Yeah. You record like this, and like whenever you, you try to move it to the side, it like makes it small. <laughs> sure. What are y'all niggas doing? Look at these big guys. What is going on? <laughs> uh, look at that. Almost got this done. All it really is is the U bolts. It has a plate right there. The U bolts has a plate. Four bolts. Those come out. Release the shock. That's just one bolt. I'm going to leave that hanging. And then the shackles. I'm going to start the flip kit. Put it all back together. Uh, so far right now we already got a the shock yeah, tumble yeah, yeah. everything's loose shackles are out uh, we got that side over the leaf spring already this is this side all we gotta do is lift this pull it under over and that'll be off of the flip kit how you holding out richard mm -hmm. mm, you have to top away <laughs> <laughs> the bj over there fucking around all right y'all ready all right so it's kind of a bitch but what we had to do was take up all the brake lines Emergency breaks out, so I could finally get this one over because it wouldn't extend. But BJ ended up leaving now, just me and Richard, quiet boy. We already got everything in place. We just got to bolt the leaf string back up, the flip kit parts, put the wheels back on, and ready to roll. I didn't think it was gonna take this long, but finally got it in there. It's the flip kit going straight down. Send out the washers. I'm about to get everything tightened up. I'm gonna put the back wheels on. Should be ready to go. All right, guys, so everybody kind of left already. It's pretty late. But, uh, flip kit, shocks, everything's bolted up. I got left just to put on the wheels and get the jacks out of the way. I don't have a camera guy to record everything I do in step by step, but, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and mount these wheels. All right, guys, I already put all the wheels in. As I can see, it's kind of, it's a big difference on what it was. I just gotta take off these jack stands. Quick. They're little but useful. 
Take this one off too. Right, now I'm gonna drop the truck. guys oh that thing looks nice has the perfect rear dang i like it even more now <laughs> look at that i got to lay so tomorrow i'm gonna end up dropping the front and that'll be the last thing to do the next day yesterday was a little bit too dark for me to finish everything else probably like 12 but uh we came back out today uh basically i already got the front the stock spring in here for the front and it is gonna drop down about like two to three inches all I gotta do is just put this little cup back on the spring, put my control arm, my sway bar, and that's pretty much it for the front. We're just gonna go ahead and get this shit installed. We'll be right back. All right, so this is much later, but uh, I already got the springs on there. The only thing I don't have is the sway bar links and the shocks because uh, the shocks were kind of hard to get, so I just ended up cutting it off. And the sway bar links, I had a. Uh, messed up bushing so i'm gonna just uh, go get some new ones but pretty much about in uh, i already got this hair done the bags dropped i'm gonna just see how it does all right so there you guys have it i already have the truck dropped two inches three inches from the front and the flip kit in the rear dang i really like how it came out that's exactly how i wanted it What's up, look at that three inches in the front flip kit in the rear Yeah, right. It looks kind of leveled out, right? Yeah, it looks nice. Oh, I'm just waiting on my bumper now. That shit's gonna look fresh. Wait, there it go, there it go. Cowhead too. Cowhead? Yeah, just a little baby one. 